I'm Dr. Alan Foley. I'm with the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission, the Fish and Wildlife Research Institute, and I came here today to, uh, to give a workshop on sea turtle stranding and salvage network activities. Green turtle was probably bigger than this loggerhead, or at least similar size. So you should notice is the head is really small. I mean, it looks weird. It looks like uh, you had a witch doctor come by before you got there and shrunk the head. Oh well, this is good because it's a, a reminder, a refresher for us um, on, on how to follow the correct procedures with the sea turtle strandings. Uh, it's really important to collect the correct information when they do wash up. You can tell it's a Ridley really quick just by running your finger along this um, front part of the jaw and you can feel that hook sticking down. Uh, what we try to do is give workshops in different areas so that people don't have to travel too far. Golf Specimens is the easternmost uh, facility in the Panhandle. Golf Specimen uh, Marine Lab was a perfect place for this, uh, especially with today's weather being able to do it outdoors. The Golf Specimens was a great, great location. When you see them side by side, it's, it's easier. The loggerhead has this uh, this cross shape where it has a broad shoulder and it tapers down more to a point at the end, whereas the Kemp's is more of a disc, so it's it's pretty much round. Well, thanks everyone for coming out today to the workshop. Um, but nice venue, good weather, and uh, I hope uh, it was easy to um, get this information that is so important to do strandings.